monk can out. Just walking down. Spot my first fisherman. Right there guys, uh, it's a bit of a walk from the car, uh, been struggling for the last few days with my leg, everything, uh, as you can see, just got here, just watched the barge go up, but there's a little inlet there, you can see fish on the top, there's a lot of little fries, you can see this, let's zoom in a bit, so you can see flies on the top, you can see all fish on the top, so what the plan of action is, what the plan of action is, to uh, get pole out, fish be a really short line, try it don't work, try it dibber, got some maggots, likely feeding all the time, and uh, see if I can pick some fish up. I uh, bought a pipe rod just in case, because I know I've had pipe from here before, and sometimes it's a bit of a nuisance, so it's worth catching them, at least a bit further up and get them out of the way. So, let's see if I can catch some fish, and keep watching. Um, I've tried doing sucker method and barges come through again. Get this problem with barges here all the time. I thought today would be a better day. Uh, obviously, that's nice where it brings barges out. So, all on chocolate again. So, I've just managed to catch a rope. I've just changed it over. I've got this tiny little drennan dibber on there. Number eight shot. And a little number eight drop shot. Just that, the old length. It's about three and a half foot deep where I'm fishing, so I've just plumbed up. I'm just off bottom. I want a really slow drop through because, like I said, there's a lot of fish up in the water. I'm just going to see if it's starting to come up again. So, let's see if we can catch some fish. Don't have to be able to see this on camera. You can see there's quite a lot of little fish. There's a lot of fish on the top. So, what I'm going to be doing is feeding. Keep feeding little bits and maggots. They don't look like big fish, one's just turned. Let's see if they take it. Show me a rig in a second. What I've been doing. So I've got a couple of parts of mixed maggots. I'm just feeding. A bit closer in, down this edge, and then rest. I'm going out middle. Like I said, this water's moving, so it's water moving about, so I feel like I'm going back into the down this side anyway. So, giving itself two or three options to fish different, different things. I could always bait up another spot. As long as I know where it is, I could try that a bit later on. So let's keep feeding three different lines, like I say, and you can fish like that, long pole or short pole. So, let's see if we catch some fish. Put it in. Yeah, fish are coming back up, there's some flies coming across, and fish are coming up with flies. Two noise in a second. Feed first. So they're feeding. Fish, very good fish, double white maggot that as well. That is a good fish. At first I thought it was stuck on bottom. 
don't see any carp in this stretch. It definitely feels like a carp. Or a big, big perch. I'm struggling here. From my old mate Polfo, it's a very big perch. On oh, my pull through, it's a thing. Look at that. I didn't actually think I was going to catch them straight away because it's just bars just coming through. Right. Get this down here. Good catch. Yeah, I've just literally got here, mate. <laughs> He's a monster, he is. How's that for a perch? Oops, come out in that, barbless oaks. Let's check him. Yeah, lovely perch. So, I'm putting him a little keep net anyway. But if that's what stamp of fish I'm after, I was a fish. <laughs> we drop shot for these. And, uh, what a beautiful fish. I'm putting him back in. Put him keep net for a bit. Simmer down, mate. Simmer down. Like I say, everything's to man. I've got everything where I need it. Goes. So, like I said, that's first uh, drop down, second drop down. Sorry, I've had a, I've had a little rope. I didn't actually think I was going to catch straight away. Water's really chocolatey. But I've been watching these little fry over this side. There's a lot of little fry coming down. So, obviously, it perch are intercepting them as it's coming down. So, uh, yeah, I'm glad I got that one on camera. Let's see if we can get a few more. Man's me else's fish in mine. And then we took him. We've got a bit of bait in. Fish have just started moving again. Literally a couple of minutes, waited. That's probably too much. Like. For some reason I can't zoom this new thing. Let's see if we get an indication. Still moving. I like to follow it with pole sometimes on here. Oh, there you go. What that is across here? Look like a rat or a little beaver or something. Not too big to be a rat. That's probably where Mr. Pike sits over there waiting for it. No indication yet. I've just got them perch going and got bringing a few roach. And literally, I'm just feeding maggot. See bubbles coming up. I don't know if that's green. Just ducked into another good fish. That barge is coming down. It will be in a minute. Brilliant spot on this bottom. Double, ma double white maggot. Another good perch. A bit smaller than last lot. And we've got a barge coming down to spoil it. It's proper swell with it down here. Barber sucks straight up. Oh. See, I'm still fishing long pole. Then I've got a bream. And as you can hear, another barge is on its way down. Like I said, I'd actually think this would be a good day. It's about 7 o'clock at night now. And barges are still working their through. Another 
with an ice cream. Definitely need a rag. Covered in meters, that one. Absolutely covered in it. So, do we catch them up? As you can see, as you can see, that boat's just gone past. So, there's a lot of rubbish in water now, so all water's gone there. Uh, like a milky brown again. So, what I'm going to do is mark the feed. That's the problem with this canal, boat traffic. Get a bit of feeding again. So, I'm going to get a couple of minutes. Let water settle down again. Water's moving about, although, like I say, I'm using a tiny little dibber. So it's going to get pulled all over. I can try now, but I'll give it five minutes. I'm going to drink of my juice. Always bring a drink, some food. I've had some at 4K Mount, so I'm alright. Keep yourself hydrated. As you can hear, I'm struggling because I've been sat down for quite a bit in my little my little box that's my box all made again bought a tub you don't have to go out and spend loads and loads of money like you keep saying I used to be a match angler I used to love match angling the amount of money I've spent on stuff of eight years thousands and thousands of pounds and I try and do what I can do what I've got at the moment so, I mean, you love me fishing. As you know, I've said in my past video, me uh, else deteriorated a little bit. About trying to get that better, get my scan sorted and get my legs sorted. And I'm having to get to places where I used to walk for miles, I can't do that anymore. So, enough of me rabbiting, I can see fish tapping over this, enough of me rabbiting, and let's see if we can catch some fish. As you can see, I've just upped into another good fish. That barge come past. Uh, just been absolutely plagued with roach at the moment. Another monster, monster perch. Come here, pal. Get your head up. He's moved back in. I'm literally, my partner's just rang me and I've said to her, I'm having 10 more minutes. That's probably the biggest perch at session. Come here, pal. Come on. I'll go, you. I'll go, you. I'm actually running out of uh, he's absolutely munching them up. The size of that one, it's a bigger one. Beautiful fish, absolutely beautiful perch. That's got to be a couple of pounds all day long. Look at that monster perch. As you can see. 12 pound of fish. Proper. Good hour and a half. So I'm gonna let little ones go and I'll get some pictures of bigger ones. Just weighed this first perch. That one. He weighs in at two pound five. Right there people, as you can see, ends up with decent bream. He can go back in. Get with it smaller perch. He's smaller, a little bit smaller. He's a smaller perch. He's got a two pound. Oh, come here, Paul. Sit down. Little roach. Monster perch, these. Absolute monster. Look at that. Another big perch. I'll try and get a good picture of these three. 
white biggest. He weighs in at two pound eight. Look at the size of that. That's my PB. Smash my PB. And that little lump. Two pound two. Come in, little man. I'm feeling a bit of sport. And there we go, people. There we go. Way to go. Thank you, Pop. We've gone. Happy again. Yeah, there, that's me done. Um, still plenty of light left. Could still fish, but I'm in pain with my back and everything. Uh, what I'm going to do tomorrow, I think. I might come back here. I know the season just started, but I might come back here once I go river fishing. So what I might do is bring my rod uh, and try a little stick float just dragging through. It seems to be a lot quicker. So that's what I'm going to do. I've not had time to do it now, so let's see. Catch them tomorrow. Right there, I did say yesterday that I want to come down and uh, use my little drenning. I had a smaller one than this, but I'll put this one on. Little drenning flow, um, little rod and reel. So I'm sat in a nice comfy chair. Yesterday, my back was killing. Um, everything's to hand, hand in there, it. maggots, everything I need, it's all here. I can sit here and cast out. There's just a barge coming down, so uh, get used to the barges for the day. Uh, what I've done on the rig, my float, so it's the same depth as it were over day. There's two number, I think they're number sixes on that. A little number eight shot, another little number eight shot, and a little number eight drop shot, and obviously the milk length. So I want it still to drop down slow. So I'll let this barge go through and uh, Get some fishing done. Sad a nice size roach. I'm getting plagued with roach. Honestly, plagued with roach today. I've just got this one on. I've been struggling all day, I've been barges all day. Up and down, up and down. I've had two perch. An absolute boatload of roach. Come here, mate. Nice perch. There you go. Not as good as yesterday. Proper struggle today. But. Had a few. Oh, come here, mate. Let's get a better fish out. Do a decent sized roach. And another big perch. Oh, that's the silvers, little silver fish. Plagued with roach today. They've all gone back in. So, I'm still learning about this canal. So, I enjoy it anyway. I've caught plenty of fish. I've uh, had a lot of problems with barges. It's been 15, 20 barges today. Really struggled. Um, I fished on uh, Waggler. I fished 
on a little stick float. I tried all sorts. It was just the fish weren't there. The fish weren't there, and obviously the barges don't help. So, thanks for watching all these uh, canal videos, and see you again.